Hello and welcome to the 7 o'clock news from Bahrain International with me, Keith Johnston. His Majesty King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa today arrived in the Kingdom after a brotherly visit to the United Arab Emirates, the UAE. His Majesty had departed UAE earlier where he was bid farewell by the Crown Prince of Abu Dhabi, the Deputy Commander of the UAE Supreme Allied Forces, Sheikh Mohammed bin Zayed Al Nayan, a number of senior officials in the UAE and the Bahraini Ambassador to UAE, Mohammed bin Hamad Saga Al Muada. His Majesty King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa sent a cable of good wishes to the President of the United Arab Emirates. His Highness Sheikh Khalifa bin Zayed Al Nayan, in which he expressed a sincere congratulations to His Highness on the occasion of the new year, 2018, Year of Zayed. His Majesty the King wished the UAE President continued health and to the UAE people further prosperity under the leadership of His Highness His Majesty. The King paid tribute to the late Sheikh Zayed bin Sultan Al Nayan and his great efforts for the UAE development and the progress of its people. His Majesty also hailed the role of the late Sheikh Zayed in consolidating and strengthening the historical relations that bind the two brotherly nations and progress in all fields. His Majesty affirmed that the leadership of the people of Bahrain will continue to remember with pride the honourable stances towards them. His Majesty said that the late Sheikh Zayed is a symbol of wisdom and generosity, not only in the UAE and the region, but also at Arab and international levels, and that his positions and initiatives continue to be seen as a modern leader, appreciated by all people and countries of the region and the world. His Majesty King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa exchanged cables of good wishes with the leaders of Arab, Islamic and friendly countries for the advent of the new year 2018. His Majesty the King expressed congratulations and wishes of abundant health and happiness for the leaders and their people and continued development and prosperity for their countries, wishing hope for the new year to be a year of peace and prosperity for all world countries. His Majesty King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa sent a cable to the President of Sudan, Umar Hassan Ahmed Al Bashir, marking the country's National Day. His Majesty the King wished the Sudanese President continued health. His Royal Highness, Prime Minister, Prince Khalifa bin Salman Al Khalifa, exchanged cables of good wishes with leaders, Prime Ministers and Crown Princes of Arab, Islamic and friendly countries on the advent of the new year 2018. His Royal Highness wished abundant health and happiness for the leaders and their people and continued development and prosperity for the countries, voicing hope for the new year to be a year of peace and prosperity for all world countries. His Royal Highness the Prime Minister, Prince Khalifa bin Salman Al Khalifa, sent a cable to President of Sudan, Omar Hassan Ahmed Al Bashir, on the occasion of his country's National Day. His Royal Highness the Prime Minister wished the Sudanese President continued health and for the people of Sudan further progress. His Royal Highness the Prime Minister sent similar cables to the First Vice President, General Bakri Hassan Saleh, and Vice President, Hassabu Mohammed Abdurrahman. His Royal Highness the Crown Prince, Deputy Supreme Commander and First Deputy Premier, Prince Salman bin Hamad Al Khalifa, exchanged cables of good wishes with leaders and Crown Princes of Arab, Islamic and friendly countries on the advent of the New Year 2018. His Royal Highness wished abundant health and happiness for the leaders and their people and continued development and prosperity for their countries, wishing for hope for the New Year to be a year of peace and prosperity for all world countries. His Royal Highness the Crown Prince, Deputy Supreme Commander and First Deputy Prime Minister, Prince Salman bin Hamad Al Khalifa, sent a cable to President of Sudan, Umar Hassan Ahmed Al Bashir, marking the country's National Day. His Royal Highness the Crown Prince wished the Sudanese President continued health and for the people of Sudan, further progress. His Royal Highness the Crown Prince sent seven cables to the First Vice President, General Bakri Hassan Saleh and Vice President Hassabo Mohammed Abdurrahman. Good evening and welcome to the business news on Bahrain International. I'm Bara Abdallah. The Italian company Prismian signed a contract with Electricity and Water Authority 
for the development of the electricity network in the kingdom and the extension of cables of land and sea power with lengths of about 59 kilometers and a deal value reaching up to 96 million U.S. dollars. The contract includes the design and supply of equipment along with the implementation of the project. The company will supply three types of lines to operate the new 4 kilometers and 400 kilowatts high-frequency power line. The isolated sea lines will be approximately 13 kilometers long, while there will be three land lines with lengths of about 46 kilometers. The new power line is expected to be completed before the end of the next year, 2019. The Italian company will manufacture power lines at the plants in Finland and France.